I found a rather unheard company that's making a new type of regenerative energy system for electric vehicles. Just like the regenerative braking, which uses the brakes to put energy back into your battery, this uses your suspension. This product, which is comically called Roadkill 5000, it uses the vertical vibrations of your vehicle and puts energy back into it. They've made a few versions, some for cars and some for heavy trucks, and they claim that it's highly efficient and can be retrofit, like it can go on existing systems without having to read design the whole thing. That's quite cool, you know, if your road or the terrain that you travel usually is bumpy, then you can put some energy back into your battery with this. They claim that it gives you 2x the power at same RPM, and on the applications section of their website, they've also included wind and tidal energies. I mean, they haven't updated the description, so I'm thinking, how does it match to wind and tidal? Maybe they're talking about ships? You know, ships kind of rock like this up and down on the ocean. Maybe that can use the power somehow, but will it even be anything substantial for a huge vehicle such as a ship. Depending on the size of the vessel, they need a lot of power, right? And what do they mean by wind? Again, it's not clear how the Roadkill 5000, you know, applies to that. But uh, maybe they're talking about, you know, using the turbulence and natural movement you have in various medium to create energy. I mean, hey, it's a good concept for sure. It is working on road vehicles at least. And we could use as many innovations as we can because electric vehicles seem to be the future. Many large states in the US like New York and even California California have banned the sale of gas-powered vehicles after 2035. I know there is still time, but you can't buy or sell a gas-powered vehicle after that. So EV is the future. So anything that adds to its efficiency and makes it better is a welcome innovation. Anyway, the Roadkill 5000 is made by Gig Performance, a strange company name, but again, they're a small company for now. You can find out more at gigperformance.com. I'll link it down below. Check it out and let me know what you think.